Okay, it is I, Rhett. Um, here's a quick video, because I always forget things, so I'm going to really make this for myself. Maybe you'll find it useful too. How do you add a shutdown button to your Raspberry Pi? Here's my Pi, and there's my button. So, uh, these buttons, they're just, they're contacts, which is so when, when you push the button, it, it like shorts something. And uh, so you can find these anywhere, these buttons. And so I have it hooked up to two of the pins right here, and I followed some instructions online. Here's the, the basic side, and I'll, I'll put a link to this. And so what you do is two parts. One, you need a, a Python program that shuts it down. Here is my Python program that shuts it down. Let's see if I can make it a little bit bigger. Window options. Okay, I'm not gonna do that. Okay, so you can hopefully see that. So it really just says import uh, OS so that you can tell it to shut down, and then I have this uh, using GPI zero button 21. And when if you get, if the button turns on, you shut down the computer, that's it. Now you can run that. And then when you run it, you push the button, it shuts down, but you don't have to run that every time. So in order to make this Python script run every time you need to go over here to your terminal and you say sudo nano slash etc slash rc dot local and this is just a text editor and then you go down here at the end almost to the end and you add this line right here two lines sudo su so it runs as super user and then echo and then pi this is this is actually just the location of the program that i made i called it shutdown press simple dot py and add that and in there and then this other stuff which i don't understand and then here's a problem that mine wasn't working correctly this exit zero has to be at the end and then that's it save it and then you're done okay so let's see how it works so here i have my button i'm going to push my button and the pie shuts down and this is really useful if you need to run it headless so you have it doing something and you want to be able to shut it down without having to just you know do something else so that's it